The initial setup requirements for this video series are pretty minimal. There's no set version of Cold Fusion or Lucy that you need to have installed. The only things you need to have are Command Box, a modern web browser, and an editor for writing code. You can download Command Box from the Order Solutions website. There are options available for Windows, Mac, and Linux computers. To run Command Box, you'll need a Java Runtime or JRE installed as well. There are versions of Command Box available that both include or leave off the JRE, depending on what your needs are. Once you download Command Box, it's recommended that you run Command Box from a folder in your system path. That way you can use Command Box from any folder on your computer without having to do any extra work. I'm running on a Mac. Here you can see I've added Command Box to the user local bin folder. The JRE Command Box uses is also in that folder. If you're on a Windows machine, the steps and folder names are slightly different, but you'll get the same end result. Place Command Box and the JRE in a folder that's part of your system path, and that should be all you have to do. You can see here is Box, and here is the JRE system folder, both in my user local bin folder. That's sort of the default location. You can install tools like this on most current Macintosh computers. Once you've done that, you can open a terminal window to check that Command Box is running properly by simply typing the word Box. The first time you do this, Command Box will need to download some setup libraries and make a few configuration updates to your machine. So the first time you run this, it can take a little while to set up Command Box and get things going. But after that, you should see what I have on the screen pretty quickly every time you run Command Box. Command Box will handle installing Lucy and Adobe Cold Fusion for us as well. It will also be used for setting up our new Cold Box applications, adding features to our applications, various pieces of testing functionality, and much more. We'll get into those details later, but for now, just make sure you've got Command Box working like we have here, and you should be all set. For the web browser, you can use any modern web browser that you like. For the majority of these videos, I'll be using Chrome or Firefox for the exercises. If you're more of a fan of Safari or Edge, those should also work just fine, as long as you're on a pretty recent version of the browser. You'll of course also want a working internet connection as well, but hopefully that part is self-explanatory. When it comes to code editors, you've got several options available. Really, you can use any code editor you like for writing code. They'll all work just fine. That being said, there are some benefits to using editors tailored for CFML development, so you get better syntax highlighting and assistance with debugging and so on. In addition to that, Order Solutions has made some plugins available for cold box development that streamline writing your code a bit even further. The latest version of these tools are available for Microsoft VS Code or Visual Studio Code. For that reason, I'll be using VS Code for the work done in these videos. However, if you're not a fan of VS Code for some reason, use whichever editor you like. The only difference will be small bits of work that we do that are specific to the IDE. For example, if we're discussing any hotkeys or shortcuts specific to VS Code, those might work differently in your particular editor. But again, all the code we write and all the command box functionality we discuss will all work the exact same way. In a future video, we'll get into the details of using editors a bit more. Plus, we'll show you some of the CFML and cold box related features and plugins that are available. Hopefully, this gives you enough information to make an informed decision about which editor will be most comfortable for you during this course. At the end of the day, choosing an editor is a personal decision, so use whichever one you like best.